is about uh, space. Watch that develop. Watch the like <laughs> to figure out what the you know because it's, at some point along the way I was talking with the writers of uh, Portal and Portal Two, and uh, they were complaining. Yeah, because we were both sort of commiserating about like oh it's a lot to live up to. You know the first game was so great, the first song was so great. You know geez what are we thinking trying to top it? You know and then uh, and they said yeah you know the marketing guys keep asking us. Like, so what are, what are the memes going to be? <laughs> and we're like, well, you know, we don't actually get to decide that. <laughs> but it's fun, it's fun to, uh, it's fun to see what people shout out when they start thinking about Portal. or what's left of it. Oh. <laughs> a while ago, some scientists decided that Pluto was no longer a planet. Oh. That, doesn't, that, doesn't seem, that doesn't seem right to me because they, they actually uh, said that it was a kind of planet that they just invented so that they could devote Pluto to that category. I think most scientists are probably witches. I don't think I don't think science has done anything to advance our civilization. You know, we could be doing all this with rocks and uh, whatever else they had besides rocks before they had scientists. similar in size. This is a unique fact, a unique thing in our solar system. They also revolve around each other with their faces always pointing toward one another in a very romantic fashion. Almost, almost in an embrace. A cosmological embrace, if you will. Which is why Charon felt so bad for Pluto when Pluto was so poorly treated um, and wrote this song. And I transcribed it. <laughs> where the story sort of falls apart, but anyway, <laughs> this is called I Am Your Moon. Uh -huh. 